it's Small Pet Haven here, and um, I decided that I'm going to do a pet room tour today because the last one I did was about a year ago, and everything has pretty much changed. And I'm sure a lot of people are gonna be like, "Oh my gosh, do this to your pet room!" And little do they know that that video is pretty much a year old now. Um, so, anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and start with the guinea pig cage. Over here, Virtue and Sendo. They have a 2x4, which equals to roughly about 10 square feet. I mean, this cage is huge. I can lay down on it. I Like, down in it. It's so big. Um, the guinea pigs themselves are hiding. There's Virtue. Mr. Virtue. Yeah, hi, Virtue, Virtue. And he goes and hides. And I think... And Sendo is in this one. Oh, yep. <laughs> we have a runner. There he is. There's Incendo. And the little horsey on top. And they just have their normal stuff. A lot more stuff than there was last year. Over here is my big 20 gallon whose light decided that it doesn't want to work anymore. So it, like, you can't see anything in there. <laughs> I mean, if you look closely, there's some girls. They all cluster around the top. There's four of them in there. And quite a few other fishies. Over here is my rat cage. And right here is Rex. This is Rexy. And then next to him is Moo Moo. Or Moo. Up there is Knox. And the hairless is Zev. And this is their cage. It's just a really large, it's an extra large, just, I guess, rabbit guinea pig cage thing that I would never use for either of those. Maybe a rabbit for a temporary cage, but yeah. It also has a small cage on top so that they can see they have two levels, well, three levels, that level, that level, and those two, and then hammocks. Um, over here... Let's take this out. Is my 10 gallon with two bettas. There's Patriot. I don't know if you can see him. Patriot. And then there's Miji. My beautiful Miji boy. And they are flaring at each other. As you can see, Patriot has eaten all his fins, but there's not really much I can do about that. Uh oh. <laughs> Their thing is floated away. There are also are two snails in here. Um I don't know where they are though. Oh well. Um, yeah. Meiji is my one of my new boys, and he's doing really well. Isn't he pretty? He's a half moon. Um, I also am sad to say that Cinder did pass away. Over here are my newest additions, the gerbils. They have, um, I have two males, and their cage kind of needs to be cleaned and stuff moved. Because there was a little thing here that they can easily jump up there. They still can. They jump off that ledge. But this is Bo. This black one. And the little creamy colored one back there is Bumblebee. And they're in a connected two 10 gallons. And they can't chew the tubes. So I made it so it's too high for them to be able to chew it. So they enjoyed that. Um... Over here, I have Wooden, and here's the cute little guy himself. I know, Bubby. Here's Wooden. He's very, he's very curious. Yes, buddy. I know, I know. Hi. Okay. But that's Wooden. Move your fingers. Move your fingers. You don't want to pinch your fingers. Okay. And he is in a two-level critter universe, I think. And it has a tunnel that goes to a space pod and a little pod here that I actually broke but it's it's still pretty sturdy and I slid it back into place and then he connects to a 10 gallon with his silent spinner a little strawberry and just that why are you chewing? you shouldn't be chewing and over here is my big 20 gallon tank with Mr. Mustache who always Mr. Mike Mustache who always wants to say hi and the four zebra danos there were five. Oh yeah, I remember one of them died. Um, 
and the crap ton of snails. Snails, snails, snails. I mean, I'm not even kidding. If any of you people who have aquariums want a snail, look at all these snails. You can have one. I let, um, look at them all. I let my mystery snails breed. I mean, these are like $3 snails. And, um, this is what happened. <laughs> and back there is my cute little girl, Scrubby Bubbles. Who is, like, all up next to a snail. There are snails everywhere in this tank. And there's Daddy back there. They get pretty big. Um. What the? What the? How is, how is that? How is that possible? Look. He's floating on top of the water. Like he's moving on it. That, that is just, that, okay. <laughs> okay. And there are my moss balls that I'm trying to revive. I'm not sure if that's going to work, though. Um, here is my five-gallon tank with a, one albino quarry cat. I can't keep her in any other tanks, and she, you know, she fits in here, and I can't get her more because all the ones that I find are either A, sold out, or B, they all have egg. Um... That is. Oh well. Um, and then right there is my pretty boy Cottus. Yeah. He's so big. Yeah, he's so pretty too. And over here, I have two more bettas and a 10 gallon. Um, of course it's split, just like all my others. There's Tao, who is a Delta. And then there is, um, Biga, who is a double tail. PK. And then over here is my boo bunny, which everybody has been wanting to see and have talked about. And he hasn't had many videos made for him because he has been bad. Yeah, you've been bad. Tried to escape and run away. So, yeah. He's he's been bad. Over here are two more of my buddies in a split 10 gallon. There's Abaddon. And then, um, there is Dante, because one of my boys passed away. He was, like, th almost three years old, though, so it's okay. He's my pretty Abaddon. I love my Abaddon boy. He's so big and pretty. And then over here is Wolf Eyes. He's a veil. And here's Sammy. He's a veil. And he's black, and you can't see black. Oh well. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much my pet room. I have quite a few animals. I have hamsters, gerbils. <laughs> well, I don't have hamsters. I wish I could have another Syrian hamster, but I don't know if that's going to happen before I move. Maybe once I move, I'll get one. Because I still have that big cage. Um, yeah. If you guys have any questions or comments, go ahead and just list them below. And, um, yeah. That's pretty much it. I also am planning on doing a, um, a storage tour. All that and that and that and that and that and that. Oh, and that. <laughs> I have a lot of storage. Um, but if... Anybody's interested in like, I don't know, six to eight part series of me going through each and every one of my drawers, I will. If not, then I won't because it's just going to take forever to upload. And yeah, that's it. Small Foot Haven out.